Hey everybody, it's Cubic Tom. It's time for load bearing bricks. Oh hey, we recognize this music. A to MT. Now, what have you got to say, Monopoly man? Hey, be careful. These are load bearing bricks. If even one breaks, this whole building will collapse. Well, let's not take any chances with shells or anything. I'm glad I destroyed that. Or just why do shells not turn into coins when you break them? Oh boy. So we go through this way. Actually, where is this music used in A2MT? Or is it used in A2MT? Is it safe to go down here? Mm, yes it is. It's way safer than what I wanted to try to do a minute ago. No 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 Ah, uh, this is what happens. Yeah, so is that music ever used in A2MT anywhere? I don't remember. Uh-oh. Actually, ice blocks aren't good. I prefer the fireballs in this case. So we're going to have people who want to ambush us. No, no, no. You just safely, safely down there. And then here we just want to go below. Burn, 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 burn. Go, 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 go. Thanks for jumping. Demo. You're always so good at jumping. Actually, it's now way safer that I'm small. <laughs> but uh, I don't want to get hit by the enemies, which are everywhere, of course. Oh, it's, I, I tried. You saw me trying. I knew that would happen. Got to aim better with these. Oh yeah, it can aim upwards and downwards in this engine. It's super weird. So much for trying to spin jump. Right. Let's pop you. Pop you. Grab this. It's not too much use except against the enemies. So let's just stay down low. Now what I'm going to do is grab this sh shell, wait for this one to pass. Oh yeah, I can spin jump while holding objects. Again, weird engine. No! Of course it ends up being me setting it off. Get the, uh, demo, why do you have no momentum? Let's switch to someone who has momentum. Like, I, I keep saying no momentum, I mean they have no acceleration. Like, I'm a physicist. Like, I, sh I should know these things. Right, let's have... Acceleration. Man, this feels much better already. Yeah, look, I can accelerate. Pop. Oh, this feels much smoother to control. Right, just make the jumps. Damn it, I wanted this. But, like, at least when things go wrong, I can run, but... Jump buttons don't work all the time. I just like it's not actually a hard level. It's just just have to be quick. You have to be extra careful, especially when you're big. Like this level, you cannot. If you're Iris and you're big, you just can't play this level. Like your normal jumps are just gonna. Wreck everything. Well, that worked. Protect me, helmet. Where did my shell go? Did... What happened? What happened with my shell? Did I hit something and not notice? Now, in fairness, because the screen is so big... I... Oh, whoops. I'm not as attuned. Uh... Like, you know, when I'm looking at stuff around the screen, it's not like in SMW where, like, the character is still in my peripheral, peripheral vision. It can be very much not the case. Yeah, my shell just despawns. What? Why is, why is my shell despawn? Game. Right, let's do this level for real. And oh, Why? I like I I can't I have no explanation for why this this particular thing keeps on happening. But uh, 
hoping to despawn the guy or something, but it's not SMW. Like, why can't I jump up this staircase? Damn it. Oops. Like, it's obviously a much... It's obviously a much better idea to spin jump instead of picking up the shell. Like, why not just destroy it? I am not on SMBX forum today. But... I still felt that things went better than normal. Man. It's the difficulty of this game actually picking up. But this is a level that, you, you know... If you don't mess up, you're doing your first try. Now, I know that's sort of true for all levels, but I mean, it's easy to do in your first try. Yeah, I'm just not fast enough for that, dude. Make it. Okay. Just wait a minute. Yes! Perfect. Now there's probably going to be more shell kicker dudes. Good spin jump. Oh, there's the midpoint all along. Alright, what's next? Those two are going to be fighting amongst themselves. Well, I'm going to look for a power up. I'm going to make sure to destroy everything all at once. So, uh, thanks for being good, fireballs. Okay, they're all walking two by two. But I think this is impossible now. Oh, damn it. Oh, maybe not, 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 maybe not. Second half, way easier than the first half. Because it was vertical. Let's move on. The good, the bad, and the stupid. A level made by Raukow, I believe. We are a demo. That's what this entire world is based on. Right. Right, so let, why can't I... I can't spin jump off of... Of course. I can't spin jump off of cat llamas. Like, it is terrible. Um, are these all coins? Apart from that one radish. Very possibly. Okay, you're just, you're just sniff it. It's, why, why? I pressed the spin jump button, but you're normal jumping off the cat llama. It, it makes no sense. Oh, he was helpless and... Uh, such a rude cat llama. Yeah, okay, there's nothing in the soil. Let's bring this with Oh, this goes. Let's bring this with us. Ye olde gold mine. Oh, that's the little elevator. We spat out our fireball. Alright, is there a power up here? We're in the there's not much gold in the Oh, finding some gold. It's under the grass here, guys, you missed it. Oh and someone lost a tooth. The music is kind of interesting. Oh, uh, uh, well, do you know what? That that clump of grass can stay in there. Like, why am I? This is a desert. Why am I picking up all the grass? Can I? No, that's not what I wanted to have. Uh, I wanted to do. Oh, you killed me! Like, uh, so obviously those green switches are blocking something nice in. In the ground. But let's just let's just do the level. Let's just do the level. Let's keep our desert companion with us. We're on the cat llama with no name here. Okay, let's go this way. You didn't. I. I was obviously pressing the jump button. I'm sure you could hear it in the background. The little clickety clack of the. Okay. Calm down. Calm down. You don't want to lose your head in the desert. Out in the west. Okay, there we go. There, thanks, jump button. Thanks for working this time. Oh, still working. Nice. Nice, good job. Gonna give you a promotion. Watch out for the uh, singular lava pit. Let's take the elevator all the way down. And then the elevator breaks and we fall the rest of the way. So this time, 
Can I? No. So I'm probably supposed to use the bomb up there to get the switch down there, but it's not happening. Okay. There's a singular fish. And let's go in this pipe in midair because it's this engine. There's the Yoshi skull, which if we stand on it, will it behave like a ch No. Okay. Fair enough. Cool Johnny's Discount Catlama Ranch. Oh, I can't take any of them. Or, yes. Howdy, stranger. You'd best hurry along. The famous Catlama Rustler King Frog Bandito is heading out in El Char... Charlatorio? Hiding out in El Charlatorio. I don't know what that is. Uh, this darn evil doer keeps rustling up all the Catlamas. That just vexes me so hard. Hey, Kelly, okay. Howdy stranger, do you want to rent one of our fine discount cat llamas? Our prices are always negotiable. Sorry stranger, we only accept American gold, not this weird floating coin version. Well, if you want to get rid of the King Frog Bandito first, I suppose you can borrow all red rusty. Sweet music. Oh, so I can, this is red rusty, is it? Well, I I like my... I Trusty steeds are trusty, so let's keep... The, oh no, it's not there. Oh no, it's the various different coloured Koopas that may or may not be unlocking things. Well, yeah. sure. What have we got here? El Charlatorio, capital of the lungfish salad. Why would there be fish salads in the desert? I've, I've lost my trusty steed. Let's power up with a fireball. Uh, check this grass, because we're ignoring grass for a little. Whoa, you go off on your merry way there. We're attacked by Twitters. For some reason there's infinite number of them oh no i need i need the key do you know what i'm just gonna stand here while you get me the key actually i'm sort of nervous about just standing here while it says saloon there instead of ghost house this is this is slow you're gonna oh no you're gonna end up killing yourself oh do you know what that was a very well placed bomb over there beside the key oh why did it blow up I know it's a bomb, but what? Why? Oh, they they keep spawning. Just don't blow up my key. Right, let's just wait for all those bombs to blow up. Go through the door. Is it safe in here? Okay, that's just a normal wart. What do you want, stranger? Demo? Are you the King Frog Bandito? Uh oh. What if I am? Heard you were causing some kind of ruckus. I think. Don't want, I don't know what rustling means. <laughs> I like the way that the watch power-up is used as a clock in the background and Luigi is the bartender here. It's uh, abstract. I reckon you better be minding your own business, little lady. Uh, sorry, guy. I'm a player character. My business is getting into other people's business. Well then, I reckon we should settle this the old-fashioned way. And since this level is a period piece, this means the contemporary way. Again, as a player character, I agree with your stipulations. Nary a second thought. Groovy, let's see you in the back. Sure was, good scene. I'm so glad I replaced that sound effect with a cracking noise. Oh, there's this. Can't grab the watch. Hey, Luigi. I'm an M I'm a, an NPC. That is hard to read. I like the way a bubble is being used as the sun. I'll type music now. Tweeter, the not corrupt sheriff. All right, you two, I want a fair fight. You both may draw on the count of three. No biting, please. One. Wind, nature. I can't move. Two. Frog King over there has an L. Uh, maybe you have a health bar. He certainly has a name. Taking your, taking your time there, Tweeter. I can't move. Tweeter. Three. Draw. Demo is real quick on the draw. Hooray! Volen solved all our problems. We've learned our lesson. What have you got to say? We've enough frog meat to feed our families for months. Hooray! Yeehaw and stuff. This sure, this sure was an end to World Three. Oh, you're filthy and covered with frog gore. Can't ride me until you clean yourself up. Uh. <laughs> loot the place a little bit more loot the place a little bit more actually since that's an ending over there let's 
see, once we go in the water, we actually clean ourselves up. So let's grab this leak here, which won't end the level. Uh, because I don't think this was originally meant, like, intended to be an end of world level. See, now that we're all cleaned up, we get our crusty seat back. And there's, there's the sun. Oh, it's not interactable. But it's still, it's, it's cute. It's cute. Please go in the hole. Oh, okay. Thank you for playing the good, the bad, and the stupid. A level in three acts. Starring Demo Rose Claire as the Lone Wanderer. Wart Wilson as the Frog King Bandito. Wuffles Catnip Iglesias as Rough and Tumbles. And for the first time in theatre, Luigi, Mar Luigi Mario as an NPC. The end. There's Super Lego. Let's take that ammo with us. And that's it. That's World 3. All done and dusted. I hope it... Yeah, certainly dusty. It was a desert. Um, I hope we didn't miss any exits or levels or anything, but I think we, we, think we got all the stuff that there is to get. A second Mario Brothers X thing. Even though we're playing with the Demo Sisters, but whatever. Okay. Everybody's celebrating. Looks all good. Let's not keep the excitement growing any longer. I don't know if this year's Tony Award is... Iris, what? You did literally nothing in this world and you win the Tony Award. Iris is delighted. Iris is something. You acted extraordinarily in this world. This musical will not have been the same without you. Oh, this is a musical. There's the music down there. As a second or more, I had five main characters in this game. We'll sing the replies of the lullaby. Okay, now we have to listen to Raukau sing. There should be music and let's all sing together. I'm not singing. I don't do karaoke. Oh no. Oh no. Please don't do karaoke. Please. Why? 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 End of World 3. And we're out of here. Yeah, that. so the lullaby song came to being, I believe, in an ASMT level near the end. And ASMT might be one of the next games I play. I'm scared about that. Um, uh, uh, let's end in the hub. The hubba hub hub. Nice. The 24 leaks. Ah, uh, oh, because of the stairway, we lose this guy. But now we have access to Ice World. I uh, will we'll be back in a minute. So, actually, I think we have new s stuff in here. Four super. No, I only have three super leaks. Well, let's top up our lives real quick. Like I've been using the life farm here, but I'm. I'm completely sure that if I wasn't using the life farm, I wouldn't have had any issues thus far. Like, I haven't been losing that many lives for World. World 3, I had some problems, so they tended to be sort of stupid problems. Uh, yeah, I don't think we unlocked anything else at all but the next world. So let's end by being sad that we lost our, our Yoshi. Oh, you're still there. Nice. Awesome. Uh, what are you doing here? Hey there, guy. The game really starts to pick up here. If you haven't used the ship's life farming system already, now would be the time to start. Especially since we can't warp you back until you beat each world. Yeah, our teleports don't work till we collect the super leak. It's a uh, it's a plot point, I'm sure. Well, look at that! Look at that giant snowman. So uh, next time on A2XT, Ice World.